Hey, I'm Joe S. Miller, and I'm from Meadowlark Log Homes. I just want to welcome you to another successful log home build that we've that we're at here in New York. Uh, we're in central, east central New York, and we got here. Uh, well, today is Thursday, and Thursday noon, and we're just finishing up. We got here um, a little over a week ago, so we got here on a Tuesday night. We started laying logs. It took about a day and a half to set the logs in this cabin. Um, let's see. It took about. Uh, See, Wednesday, Thursday to lay the logs. By Saturday night, we had the rafters on the roof. And then Monday, we worked on the windows. And the Tuesday and Wednesday, we finished the windows. And today, we're cleaning up and wrapping everything up. So we're excited to get back home. But I'll show you a little bit around how, what we did here and show you what uh, this cabin looks like on the inside. One thing I want to make a note of here is he's got a porch on two sides of the house. Um, and then with the front door going out the center so he can sit down on his deck. In this particular instance, the customer wanted to uh, just have an upper and a lower rail and he wants to run cable through the center instead of having spindles. So that was something that we uh, allowed him to do for a custom railing. Now the outside of these Anderson windows are trimmed in cedar. And we got here, the customer had the deck all done and the subfloor are done so all we had to do was put up the logs we did the easy part <laughs> so when you pull in the drive this is what you're going to be seeing the front porch coming in here you got two windows with a loft on the upstairs and on the back here you can see the joist that's going through the wall get a little bit closer look here this helps tie the two walls of the house together a wall going through the house two windows on this side and he's got this on a concrete uh, poured wall with the uh, styrofoam blocks that's a really nice feature that makes for a nice insulated uh, basement and then you can actually screw your drywall right to there for the inside and the outside you can put your rocks right out against that so we'll take you inside here here he's got a nice little feature how you do the front of the deck leading into his house and he chose a it appears to be a western cedar for his deck it's very nice it's a little soft wood but uh, I guess it's what he wants and it does look beautiful so this is the deck this is the um, the door leading out to looking overlooking the woods we'll step into his house here you've got a stairway going up to his loft. And he's got a, a just a little over half loft, about a three quarter loft upstairs. And we'll look at that in a minute. There's his stair railing. We weren't able to finish that because he needs to get the loft floor put on and he'll do that himself later, I guess. I'll show you how these windows are trimmed out. On the top here, you've got a, a bit of a shelf which is a nice feature. In the bottom, you've got a little bit of a shelf there as well. And again, these are Anderson windows, but they can be, um, you, we can install any window that the customer chooses. So that's not a problem. I believe his dining room will be over here in this corner. And it's kind of tiny, but his living room will be over here. And then you will have a kitchen over in this area right here. And this will be the entrance with the door right over here. So, and you have a little, I believe there's a, a bathroom right at this window. So here's a stair landing going up. Here's our stairways with the decorative fasteners underneath. And these logs are a bit dirty, but they will get sanded and, and finished. Go upstairs here. There'll be log railing going right across the end of this, tying into the wall. And here he'll have a light switch right in this post. So he can just turn the light on as he comes upstairs. And he's got the cans already in for the upstairs of the, the boxes. So now this also, customer chose to have uh, several extra rows, I believe four rows of logs 
higher on the side. So that gives them a lot more headroom. So you can walk all the way to the edge here. And uh, this, you can stand right beside this log and it's, you can still tuck a bed underneath there and you'd be fine. So there's quite a bit of space up in here still. And then looking this way from the loft, you'll have a view looking out that direction. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. And um, if you have any questions, comment below or give us a call at Metal Arc Log Homes. The toll free number is 800 850 8554. Of course, our web address is metalarcloghomes.com. And our YouTube channel is Amish Meadows. And on Amish Meadows, we feature some of the other things that we do on our Amish community in Libby, Montana. So hope you enjoyed that. And uh, if we can help you, don't hesitate to ask. Thanks for watching.